it, it, that's the kind of stuff for a three-year starter. You're like, okay, you can't do that. Um, so he's definitely culpable. He's missed a lot of throws that were wide open. Um, I think um, the, the system and the scheme is getting to know each other still and hasn't really clicked together real great yet. It needs needs to do that this week, and I think it'll change a little bit more. From, I think it's it's done well at times, but put together a complete game, it hasn't done, and, and it needs to do that. What can you say about the way you just kind of help fuck up the East? The West always seems to be a dark place. Florida's doing okay. Yeah, yeah. Florida's pretty good in a row. Back to back back to back ten win seasons for the first time. By the way, since 2008. I mean, so Florida's doing um, doing their their share and doing well. But I mean, Georgia's third three times in a row here. that's pretty daggum good. I think if you had told Georgia fans that if Kirby got hired, they'd be like, sign me up for that. How about three years ending where you're in the conversation to be in the college football playoff? That's that's pretty daggum good. And, and again, I feel like we say it every year, but it's still a pretty young team. I mean, you're not going to lose much on defense. Offensive line, who leaves early? Um, who leaves early? Swift? You know, he will leave early. When he leaves? Um, how many leave, I guess, will be the, the better question. So it's, it shows a lot about Kirby and um, how he's been able to recruit and restore. David, what is the trick to, to the LSU offense? What, what's made it so unstoppable and so versatile in what they do? There ain't a trick, bro. <laughs> I mean, it's not a trick. It's They know how to execute. They know exactly if you blitz them, they have their answers. And um, if you want to play cover one, they're going to hit deep overs and they're going to hit uh, fades and goes. And they just they do a good job if you're going to play dime and nickel. They're going to run duos all day and run the football at you. And so they just – they do a really good job of knowing how to attack every level of a defense. It's not like it used to be. I, I feel like offense for a while trended towards Golden State. Like it was threes and dunks. It was goes and screens. And they do a good job with their mid range and attacking. But it's just they do everything well. I mean, there's no. That's why it's hard to say. Okay, I want to take this away. I want to take this away. Every time you do, um, they have an answer to try to try to try to answer that. It'll be fun. I think Kirby as brilliant as he is defensively, can come up with something to make a few plays. I mean, Tua last year had it rolling, you know, coming into the dome and um, cooled off big time. But obviously got hurt too. So it's just finding – what can you find that can slow him down for a possession and you win? You know, Auburn tried the tower approach and tried to go, you know, three down and bring in a bunch of speed. It kind of worked. What, what can you bring in and slow down just for a little bit and hold the rope and then hopefully your offense makes plays and holds the ball a little bit and – Kind of helps you. Everybody works together. David, Joe Burrow, Luke, 